I really do love water. I mean, when I was when I was young, I was the baby who cried when they took me out. And John O'Connor has been in the pool since. He's mostly a distance swimmer, holds two school records in the butterfly, but he's actually competed in every single event for the Stags. That's pretty remarkable if you think about it. But coach Bill Farley knows that's how O'Connor is. He's serious about the things he likes, swimming and his other passion. I've always been really, really interested in, in creative writing. When I was younger, um, I would write stories all the time. I had a second grade teacher who had us write journals and every single day we would write a story and her, her big thing was just start writing, keep on writing. And I was that kid who couldn't put my pen down. He's so passionate about writing, he was the perfect candidate to revive a longtime campus literary publication that went dormant, The Sound. Everything that he does, he approaches um, with care and meticulousness, and he has um, an idea of excellence that really is beyond that of most of his peers. He's as dedicated there as he is here in the pool. It's really a shame for us not to have a literary magazine if, if no one else is gonna do it, I and mean, some, someone has to do it. And so O'Connor and his co-editor, Stephania Kambanis, spend hours a day reading submissions, submissions from alumni, faculty members, and students as they prepare to relaunch the sound online. Yeah, we're taking a lot of different types of things for the sound. We're taking prose, we're taking poetry, we're taking speeches, it could be a letter, like a little post-it note that you had that might, might sound cool. With all he has going on, swimming, and the administrative duties that come with being an editor, O'Connor says he doesn't have much time to write his own stuff, but he's inspired by reading others. It's, it just said so much, and the way she wrote it was so beautiful. And somehow, through all he has going on, O'Connor remains on the Dean's List. I mean, I'm not gonna say that I have a lot of free time right now, <laughs> but you have to kind of make sure that everything's in balance, and you have to make sure that you're doing things you like, and as long as you like what you're doing, you'll make time for it and it'll, it'll work out.